This story comes out of Miami-Dade County. Specifically, it happened at Bethel Seventh-day Adventist Private School. This is Katie Ann Sewell. This is Kendra Pollard. And Miss Pollard has a son who was a little on the heavy side. And he was being fat shamed and bullied and made fun of by Miss Sewell's son. Miss Pollard's son reached down, grabbed Miss Sewell's son up, picked him up off his feet, and then put him back down on his feet. So, of course, parents were called. And it's what Miss Sewell did to Miss Pollard's son to get her arrested and charged with child abuse. See, she rolled up in that school, cussing and fussing and mad. And when she walked up to Miss Pollard's son, she pulled off her belt and started swinging and hitting him about the neck and the face and the arms. And she busted his lip. And there is a video of this, and you can see this transpire. And then she left the school, and she didn't go back home, and she didn't go to work. And it took the cops a little bit, but they finally got her and arrested her. Miss Pollard went and carried her son to the emergency room to have him checked out because he suffers from seizures. Luckily, he did not have one. Miss Sewell is being charged with child abuse without bodily harm, educational interference, and trespassing in a school zone. So I want to give a few thoughts. As far as the two boys go, there's going to be Miss Sewell's son's version, there's going to be Miss Pollard's son's version, and somewhere in the middle lies the truth. Because I'm thinking somewhere in the middle of all that was a lot of trash talking that got out of hand. So now this school, how do you allow a parent to come in, abuse a child on your premises that's in your care, and then calmly walk out the door without stopping her, without stopping the attack, without saying something to her? And as far as Miss Sewell goes, I'm having a hard time understanding how she thought it was okay to walk into this school and start beating on this child. No one should put their hand on a child in anger. But it's on a different level when you start beating someone else's child.